to YouTube. Dustin again. Um, so what we're going to do this time is we're going to do a demonstration of how to power a circuit with solar energy. As you can see here, I made a custom solar board um, using some lamps that uh, you hook up in a garden. And we cut out the solar panels and one that's out of a calculator. Uh, surprisingly, the one that's out of the calculator actually pulls more energy than the ones of the solar lamps. Um, so, what we're going to do is, uh, we'll actually get started here. First thing I'm going to do is, uh, I'm going to show you the voltage of these solar lamps. So, when you're testing voltage, I'll do, I'll do another video at some point on how to use a multimeter. But, uh, so, as you can see here with the wires, if you look at the wires, I've marked one that's black and the other one is an orange color. The reason why I've done that is because you're negative and you're positive. So I'm going to touch this lead. I'm going to touch this lead. And as you can see, so one second, let me switch it down to 20. So when you touch the leads, we're getting 3.54 volts. So your standard uh, AA battery has 1.5 volts in it. So we're getting a little over double the voltage. The only problem is, is I believe that the current and the amps actually aren't really going to match up, honestly. But uh, So what we'll do here is uh, I'm going to set up a really basic circuit with the solar panel. And uh, what will happen is uh, I'm not going to use a resistor in this circuit because there's really not that much current that comes through these. I would have to add quite a few more to have to use an actual resistor. So, uh, just as a demonstration, I'm going to uh, plug in the negative lead and then I will plug in the positive lead over here. And then we're going to use some jumpers. So, my white jumper I will use as my positive. I'm going to go ahead and plug that here. Plug the other one here. And my black lead will obviously be my negative. So I'm going to go ahead and plug that here. I'll plug the other one right underneath on the opposing sides. So as I mentioned in the previous video, is that uh, these lines, these, sorry, these pinholes, they go uh, this way. And the ones up here go this way. So you got horizontal and then vertical. So what's going to happen here is right now this one's getting power from the negative and this one's getting power from the positive. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to connect an LED in. As I mentioned before, this is your positive lead because it's longer. This is your negative lead because it's shorter. So this is going to be a very dim light. Hopefully you guys can see it. So it is solar, so it's not the greatest. So, as hopefully you can see there, that light is actually lit up, just barely lit up though. That's why I didn't put a resistor in there, because if I put a resistor in, then uh, you guys wouldn't be seeing anything at all. So, that's about it. Um, when you test the resistance on the uh, LED on its own, I don't even know if I can test it on point, but I'll try. 2.42, 2.41 volts going through. So you have a very fairly low voltage coming through after. But, yeah. But yeah. So, in other words, that's uh, that's how you make a uh, solar circuit, pretty much. Um, but anyway, I hope everybody likes, comments, and subscribes. Thank you very much. Bye.